hello uh, we are just learning how to uh, mark the spleen so spleen remember always is marked on the posterior aspect uh, and on the left side not on the right side so this one is the right side of the patient this one is the left side of the patient and uh, now we have to mark the spleen this is very important to correctly mark it so let's start let's first know that what are the points there are four important points which uh, you should know while marking the spleen first one is uh, at the level of t10 vertebra so how to count t10 vertebra in a live patient so if this one is the skeleton you know um, and it is easy to um, count but in the patient um, it is sometime difficult and how can you uh, easily do it you know that this one is the uh, vertebra prominence uh, c7 vertebra that is the first vertebral spine that is palpable so you will just palpate it as c7 and then count it down t1 t2 3 4 5 6 and 7 8 9 and then t10 so for example this one is t10 this is as t10 vertebra so t10 vertebra so the first point is four centimeter away from the t10 vertebra so this is the t10 vertebra four centimeter away and second important point is in the mid axillary line in the mid axillary line for example if this one is the mid axillary line mid axillary line and 10th rib and you have to calculate this 10th rib and you know that uh, the rib attached to the 10th vertebra is the uh, 10th rib so you will just go to this rib and in the mid axillary line this is your second point so these are two points then you will you can count down this uh, uh, you can measure this distance for example if this is uh, 14 centimeter you will go exactly in the halfway mid so this way one rib up that is the ninth rib this is your third point um this is your third point and then your fourth point is one rib uh, below that that is in the on the 11th uh, rib so 10th rib and 11th rib 9 10 and 11 rib so you will just um, join all these points and uh, then this is how you will mark the spleen this oval shape this is the superior border this is the superior border this is the inferior border this one is the medial end and this one is the uh, lateral end so this is how you can mark the spleen correctly in the exam if you are asked remember um, important things always from the posterior aspect always on the left side um t from account from c7 then t1 t uh, t1 through to t10 and then t10 four centimeter away from here and then on the same rib i'll to the 10th t10 vertebra in the mid axillary line then third point is uh, uh, on the ninth rib uh, midway between the first and second uh, point and fourth point is uh, on the 11th rib midway between first and the uh, second point and joining all these points on the posterior aspect uh, you can correctly um, mark the spleen so this is very easy thank you so much for watching